A 60-year-old reservoir woman has faced court, accused of helping Tony Mockbell flee to Greece halfway through a drug trial. The Supreme Court heard Fula Pantazis was part of a criminal enterprise that formed an elaborate plan to get the drug boss out of Victoria and keep him out of prison. Fula Pantazis was working as a cleaner when she and her pensioner husband, Byron Pantazis, organised the purchase of a $323,000 yacht. The Edwina was used to take Tony Mockbell to Athens. In 2006, while on trial for drug trafficking, Mockbell skipped bail and disappeared. He bunkered down at a friend's house in country Victoria before travelling to Fremantle to set sail. The court heard Pantazis use funds from Mockbell's drug cartel to make several trips to Greece to prepare the elaborate escape. She also helped organise three Greek sailors to sail the yacht. The prosecution argued Mockbell's escape from Australia was a family affair, with Pantazis involving both her sister and her daughter to help transport Mockbell from a hideout at Bonnie Doon to Western Australia. Both women have agreed to give evidence against her. Pantazis' daughter will also testify her mother met with Mockbell at the hotel in Athens just two days before his arrest. But defence lawyer Luke Barker said the case is founded on misconceptions and innuendos. He told the jury while it's clear a group of people, including her family, banded together to spirit Mockbell from Australia, there was no evidence the 60-year-old was one of them. Pantazis has pleaded not guilty to attempting to pervert the course of justice. Sarah Farnsworth, ABC News, Melbourne.